Africa's Great Lakes region has a complex history marked by periods of conflict and political instability. However, we often overlook the role of young people in peace building and development processes in this region and worldwide. At Interpeace, we believe that when given the chance, young people have the incredible ability to create peaceful and united communities. That's why in January 2021, we initiated an innovative peace building program with the aim to build the capacity of young people from Rwanda, Burundi, the Democratic Republic of Congo and Uganda to become active agents of peace in the Great Lakes region. Through training workshops, policy dialogues, art performances and advocacy sessions, the program provides a platform for young people to express their creativity, innovation, ambition and collaboration to promote peace. In its two years of implementation, the program has met remarkable positive changes among short-term achievements, we can mention 120 Peace Fellows and 30 young innovators who have been identified, trained and mentored to play their catalytic role in peace building in their respective countries and communities. 19 intergenerational and cross-cultural dialogues were organized reaching 649 people. These dialogues created a safe space for young people and elders to discuss intergenerational and cultural differences and promote a culture of dialogue to overcome prejudices and stereotypes. Seven policy dialogues were organized, serving as a networking opportunity between youth and decision makers, enabling young people to have access to a larger network of government officials parliamentarians, civil society, religious and opinion leaders, and building trust among them. Two cross-border peace festivals took place in Burundi and Rwanda, attracting 821 participants. A Great Lakes Youth Summit was held in Burundi in March 2023. It provided young people with a space to exchange with each other, with their elders, and political decision makers on the challenges facing the new generation, the opportunities to fully play their pivotal role in peace and development processes. Additionally, five innovative peace building initiatives received technical and financial support. The most important thing here is not the number of young people who were trained or the number of conferences that were organized. The most incredible results is the positive change that young innovators and peace fellows are making in their communities through various innovative peace building initiatives. For instance, in Uganda, they are using football for peace to challenge negative attitudes, perceptions and stereotypes between refugees of natural refugee settlements and their surrounding host communities. In past, we talk with another refugees. It is possible for peace to take place. Sometimes we can't do that. We shall go about fighting. When we talk about the stage of support for peace, we can't even imagine. So, at the moment we are not in the village, we are not in the village. 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 Tuzano muzano gobu sinje, atari moku ruwana, atari meto onganisa. Mbwenu shanga tuwaezaje mbwenu shanga lukundo ya gumomu ritwe na friendship ya gumomu ritwe. In Rwanda, through Amani Youth Expo, they are promoting young people's talents and entrepreneurship for peace. In Burundi, young innovators are promoting social economic resilience through dialogues and individual testimonies targeting mostly university students. In the Democratic Republic of Congo, the North Chivu province, young innovators and peace fellows are engaging community members, local and traditional leaders, as well as youth through training workshops, awareness raising sessions, and art to foster peaceful conflict resolution and mediation mechanisms for peace and social cohesion. Youth Lab na mambo yeye kuna tuforme ilisha tukukua inaenda yule matante zetu
Au fait, ce sont les jeunes et les jeunes comment on peut résoudre les conflits dans la rue Afrique et dans la rue In Bukavu, South Chivu province, young innovators are using entrepreneurship to strengthen individual community, social economic resilience. Government authorities and other decision makers have recognized the capabilities and potential of youth to build a peaceful and cohesive communities. The stories and testimonies of young innovators and peace fellows convey a strong belief that lasting peace in the region is possible if and only if we prioritize youth empowerment in the peace building processes.